everyone and welcome back to my channel or welcome to today's video so today i thought i'd film a pack with me video as you all know i'm going to la literally tomorrow i hate packing and i thought this would maybe make it more fun for me i don't know i hate packing like so much i did want to make this aesthetically pleasing and have so many like different camera angles and make it like really artsy but yeah it's not gonna happen like i don't enjoy packing i just so this video is in collaboration with Nasty Gal, you guys know I've worked with them before, I love their clothes. Um, so everything I show will be linked down below, they offered to send me some stuff and I was just like, you know what, perfect, I can literally take out the packaging, shove it straight in my bag, and still look cute. Oh, I've still got all my stuff from New York on here, oh I should really... Uh, no, okay. So starting off with where my luggage is from, it's from Away. You guys actually recommended it to me. I said on my Instagram story that I really wanted some like silver hard luggage that is going to be super durable but still looks cute. So many people who sell these like hard silver cases, Away was the cheapest brand that I found them for. So just a heads up if you're looking at yourself. So one last thing I want to show you about this case because I find it so cool. There's a charging dock in the back technology man we are just so advanced these days this is obviously like my little carry-on case which i'm not gonna pack with you guys because i do that super last minute like 10 minutes before i go to the airport and in this one i don't actually put stuff to like use on the plane or anything like that i put my shoes and my accessories like my bags and my jewelry in here uh i don't know why i do that i just and then this is my big case here which still has all my stuff in my way. I have two sizes. I have a medium one and then this really, really big one. Like, this is so big. I don't know if you guys can see. Okay, so. Let's do this. Welcome to wardrobe number one. Uh, yes, I did spend two hours cleaning this to make it look a little bit more presentable because, yeah, I'm a catfish. It's okay. Okay, the first thing I got was this blouse can i call it a blouse very very 60s it's very cute as you guys know i'm really trying so hard not to straighten my hair at the moment and i feel like these like 60s kind of like polka dot outfits really go well with curly hair curly, curly, curly hair okay yeah i obviously got it in white and black and um it's just really nice the sleeves are cuffed which i really like it also has a really nice zipped detail at the back and then the front the way it's cut it's not is it a square neck it's like a square neck and a v-neck so it's just really flattering especially if you have no boobs like myself it kind of just gives you something that isn't there so this is the first thing i'm gonna take i also don't um fold my clothes i roll them because you get more space in your wardrobe not your wardrobe <laughs> your case this is going to be such a messy video like i can just feel it already this thing i got were two shirt dresses i've really been into shirt dresses at the moment i think it's because you can really lay up underneath them uh we've had like a little heat wave here in the uk it's lasted four days it's raining again and it's 10 degrees so yeah i just really like shirt dresses they're so easy to just throw on you can wear them with jeans and like heels or you can wear them open with a dress underneath them in this kind of weather where like you really don't know what the temperature is going to be i sometimes even wear a polo neck underneath like a polo neck dress and just have it like slightly done up it's up this black one which the material is really really nice like it's a i call it safari material but i don't know the actual word for it it's kind of like linen but not linen a little bit more durable also on the side it's got this really nice hem where it shows a little bit of fire on the side i just think it will be a vibe i got this in a small medium and it's something a little bit more oversized a little bit more slouchy so i'm also going to take this with me as well um the other shirt dress i got was in white and it's a corduroy dress again it has the contrast like tortoiseshell buttons and this one actually has a belt as well it'll be really nice to just like cinch in the body you know create some shape you guys know the deal so i've seen your comments on my weight recently and i've also been getting so many dms about it as well so i thought i'd quickly address it quickly the honest i had with my stomach i still have i still can't eat meat bread anything right now um at the moment i'm actually being tested for something else which is like a disease in the stomach it's not serious or life-threatening but it does mean that the recovery to putting on weight is 
a lot slower than the average person and I just can't put on weight as easy as I would like myself and obviously you guys would like too but I will get there eventually you just have to give your girl a minute like seriously honestly like it will come eventually but for now this is just it okay and this is what we're dealing with I feel fine in myself I'm okay you just, I just don't have a bum right now or any thighs but it will come it will come but yeah I love stuff like this at the moment because as I said obviously I'm quite slim and having stuff that like you can create a waist with and have this come out slightly gives you the illusion of like you've got thicker thighs and stuff so I really like this and I thought it'd be really nice with like a red lip maybe and I got this in a size 8 just because I wanted it to be not like tight to my body I wanted it to be a little bit more slouchy okay so the next thing I got I was so surprised that they had this on their website I had no idea that they had a whole like vintage section with so many amazing denim pieces like I am such a sucker for a good denim pair of jeans denim pair of shorts anything that's like good thick denim like girl likes it thick the irony so i found this skirt which not gonna lie i do have this in like every single color except this color which is like a darker denim i never wear this color i don't know why i always go for like a really light wash or white um and then just black i never wear this in between so i thought i'd pick it up just to I don't know, have something different in my wardrobe. This is actually a Levi skirt, so it's actually amazing quality. It's going to last me a really long time. I got this in an extra small, so hopefully it fits. But this kind of thing is just, it's a must wherever you're going in the world. I can wear this with an oversized jumper. I also wear these under my like hoodie dresses as well, just, you know, to be safe. Don't want to show anyone anything. With vests, with long sleeves, like these are honestly so versatile. Ooh, I just thought as well. Mmm, okay, I just thought something. This on top of this dress, so it kind of looks like I'm wearing a bodysuit. The dress is like short enough for me to do that. Oh, a vibe. I did get two swimsuits from last year. I thought I'd try something a little bit different. Uh, I have ordered some to come to my hotel, so you'll see that in like vlogs and stuff that I do out there. I just get some one pieces because I never wear them. I always go for like little itty bitty bikinis that like you really probably shouldn't go out in i just get these because i thought they would also be perfect to double up as like vests as well i mean even with the denim skirt you just wear this for the day like it's so easy I picked up a white and a black i really like this one because it has a zip detail so like you can open it up as well which i really like and then this black one i think i will probably wear this more as a bodysuit than a swimsuit i mean it's perfectly fine as a swimsuit i think it's really cute but I have some like wide leg trousers I've been wanting to wear for ages and I really wanted this bodysuit where it kind of has like the side boob. Those are my two swimsuits that I have to be honest. Two I think will be enough considering the weather but um, I do have some coming to my hotel as well. Okay so this next number is very very different for me. Number one, the colour? What? I don't know what came over me when I ordered this. I was just like let's let's just try something new you know let's just branch out of our comfort zone you cannot get more extra than a gold leopard print maxi dress with a side slit love these silky slip dresses like i just think they look so nice on and to be honest yeah it's like really not my style you guys know i'm more into like the street style kind of vibe of things this is very i'm not elegant but very like girly you know very like flowy i have no maxi skirts or dresses at all in my wardrobe so this is going to be very new i don't know how i'm going to style this yet i think i'm going to wear them with white air forces just to give some sort of vibe to it i'm actually really excited to style this i think it'll be really nice and even after la like any other holidays that i have this is like the perfect beach cover-up as well perfect evening dress oh my god i love it so much it also just picked up like a plain white t-shirt it just says fs on it which i like <laughs> as soon as i saw this i really wanted it because if you go through my text messages i end all my sentences with fs do you guys say it like that i say it like that in my head this is my go-to in every sentence i'm like morning fs oh my god i'm gonna be late fs Oh, what do you want for lunch? I don't know. FFs. Never have too many white t-shirts, especially the little like slogan ones as well. I really like. If only you guys can see the way I pack this stuff in. Can you see? Oh, so organized. We love this. Another skirt, which is 
super creased, but I think you guys can like kind of get the idea of it. This brown, like belted, kind of like military style skirt. I really like this color against red, and you guys know I love a little pop of red in my wardrobe. It'd be really nice to go with like the red bodysuits I have. Um, also with like the black and white stuff I have too. I really like this color against it. Um, again with this dress, but like tucked in it where like it wraps around the front and then the belt as well i love the fact that they've got a built-in belt on this i've just realized i haven't been seeing the size on some of these this is in a size six most of the things i got were either a size six or a size eight i'll link like everything down below and then my last two clothing items i got a beach cover-up it's just like a a uh, pinstriped blue one i love this color again against like a red lip and then lastly i got a matching set the top is down here i'm not too sure if i'm going to take the matching top but it's literally just a knitted white set so you have the white tracksuit bottoms they're kind of like slouchy very comfortable i'm probably going to wear these on the plane i really don't know why i do this but i always wear white tracksuit bottoms when i'm flying and i always look so grubby and so disgusting by the time i get off the plane but i always wear it i, I don't know why slouchy very comfortable perfect for a 10 hour flight like i said i'm flying tomorrow so tomorrow morning i'll go through everything again and just be like oh my god i have no jeans oh my god i have no trousers oh my god and then just like throw it all in that is my strategy on how to pack so for like cosmetics and makeup and stuff like this i just have these like clear cosmetic bags i have i think there's like four or five of these um, so this first one is my makeup so in here I actually haven't taken this makeup out since I went to New York I just kept it in here I was just like mm, I'm gonna have to repack it again in like two weeks I might as well keep it in here at the moment I love this especially on holiday as well this is apricot jam blush by soap and glory a vibe but yeah I take all my makeup and stuff in this big suitcase because of the like liquid restriction and then in this one is my skincare I take a lot of skincare with me. I take like six moisturizers. I do have a miniature bag of this one, like a really small one that I take in my hand luggage. This one, this is also from Away. It's like black, it's sleek, it's really, really big. So this is what I usually take. My laptop in, like socks, chargers, anything I need like actually on the flight goes in this bag. Smaller one of these in the black bag to do like my skincare on the plane as well. That has small like little travel sizes in them. I'll pack that on like one side of my case. Um, underwear. Your girl needs underwear. Ow! <laughs> Bras in every colour I could think of. Undies. I'm heading out in like an hour. I need to get socks. I need to get jeans. I need to get pyjamas. I'm so organised. I haven't packed my hair tools. I use, again, one of these but the bigger size. Um, because I need to wash my hair tonight and there's no point packing it and then having to like repack it. So I'll do all that tonight. And I also need to go through the bags I want to take in the shower. I hate packing like it's not fun why do people find it fun okay, so that is pretty much it for today's video I really hope you guys enjoyed packing with me this video a thumbs up if you enjoyed it and subscribe if you're not already if you also want to follow me on Instagram then that's always linked down below but I love you guys so much and I will see you next Sunday how many more days will I wait? I made plans with you And I won't let them fall through I, 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 I.